the store. Yeah, the uh, the tap room is in the store, uh, Braxton Labs. She's a poos. What is that Bud Light? Oh, it's St. Patrick's Day Bud Light. All right, we got uh, Jameson, pretty good price. It's the Jameson Cold Brew. We've had a ton of requests for that. Let's go ahead. A little, little more than what I paid for the uh, Kraken Cold Brew. Well, I think we're going to be drinking that on the trip. Uh, I have no problem with that. Any of the other cold brews that we've had so far would be delicious. Let's do it. So what's over here? Do we see? Do I see clearance? I see eggnog. Oh, I know that's sets. a clearance now. They got uh, Kahlua holiday box sets. We love my box sets. Uh, just for people at home, that it's it's March sixth today. Mm -hmm. Um, so we're not. It's not Christmas or anything. Oh, oh rum chata that's gift really set. That's really cheap. That's pretty cheap for rum chata gift set and glasses. Oh, those are nice glasses too. Yeah. That's a, that's a hefty bottle. Since, we, you know, we're, we're staying right across the street, we might be in here frequently. A couple times. Yeah. yeah. Take that, a late night trip. That DiSarono set's kind of nice, too. Yeah, I like the, I don't know about the glasses. I'm not really. Yeah. Yeah. Sports champagne really. glasses, isn't it? Yeah. Gentleman Jack. Got a what is that, a basketball? Yeah, what, it's supposed to be like a little, a little basketball. That's kind of a. Interesting. I wonder if it might actually be a, uh, a it's a ice, it's a mold, it's a ice mold. Yeah, what is that? Cooper's Mark Bourbon liqueur. What is that? Cream liqueur. Oop. Right there. Ultra smooth. Just like my. We had a request for this, but I don't. I can't. I can't afford forty-two dollars right now. Forty-two dollars? Yeah. Jesus Christ. Well, it's scotch. Oh, is that Cruzan? Why is it's it? Cruzan it with says it's like aged, but it looks aged barely. aged rum. <laughs> with a, a extra shot of mango rum and extra shot of coconut rum. Someone already took their extra shot. Yeah. I mean, something, that one has doesn't lost both. It's not too bad up here. I like these glasses. It's pretty good. Yeah. yeah. Dewers. Dewers. Red blend. Oh, okay, this is all I need for tonight. <laughs> oh, is that dear a plastic God. bottle? Oh, gosh. No, no the one next close. to it. Clearly plastic. But these? Or that? No, that one. That's plastic. Oh, yeah, that is plastic. Oh, we need a giant captain statue. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I'd love to take... <laughs> No, you'd have a good time. Those are some actually pretty good glasses. Yeah. That's some Pappy glasses down there. Pappy. Pappy. Real. That's right. Pappy. Here you go. Look at the therapy. Yeah. <laughs> what? That is such a weird looking bottle. I, I, why I is guess. it so, like thin? So, oh, no, um, no. if you guys don't know the party stores, they have a lot of like. Oh, it actually comes with freezable ice cubes. They have a lot of like party-related equipment, but we're all, we're mostly going to stick to the uh, alcohol. Yeah. Um, so we'll skip a lot of the section, but we'll do a quick. You guys can see some of the other stuff. The bottle opener you can put up on the wall. I feel like we need this for the new bar. I do like it at the house. I wish it had our logo on it. So oh, yeah. Or even below it. I wonder yeah. if you could order something like that. Probably, Probably Etsy. Yeah. Wait, are those? Oh, those are bourbon barrel smoking chips. That's Ooh. interesting. That'd be, oh. oh, they're for grilling. Yeah. yeah. It's pretty cool. Yeah. All right. I didn't see these. Holy shit, these are cool. Candles, alcoholic candles. I'm going to go ahead and say the maple's going to smell the best. I'm going for vanilla, man. Mm. The apple smells pretty good, though. I don't know if it smells like bourbon. Yeah. Uh, it smells like just kind of general. More like a Yankee animal. candle is what it smells like to me. Yeah. It's of maple. Not yeah. exactly the bourbon. Well, let's actually smell the bourbon one. It kind of smells like bourbon? No. Not really. It's more vanilla even than bourbon. Yeah. I mean, bourbon is supposed to be kind of vanilla. It just smells like a vanilla candle with something else in it. It could be good. I mean, I mean, I was wondering how much how much is actually seltzer and how much of it is wine. Yeah, who knows? Yeah, it's like a counter open. It sucks.
More 99 cent bottles. all the way back there, so throw down the end. It's around. Yeah. This place just keeps getting deeper. I've never seen this before. You know, I didn't start a yet. We might have to have some of this for the morning. Mm -hmm. Oscar Blues, low calorie, high haze. That sounds pretty interesting. We're going to do what my, my dad Ultra. and his family do. We're going to make Bloody Maria's where you use tequila instead of vodka. Sounds terrible. Oh, it's not. Look at all the white claws. Oh, so much white <laughs> Hey, I think that's, that's uh, the new variety pack right there. Is it? Yeah. There ain't no Steel Resolve. Steel Reserve is going to be missing out, man. Still, we haven't reviewed any of those flavors, so. Uh, it's so painful to buy that. Yeah. Oh, oh there's the pure flavor. There's just a non flavored one. Yeah. There's, an, there's a non flavored one. It's just straight up alcohol. That doesn't sound good Look at all. The, there's so many seltzers. Like, I haven't heard of half of these. Crook. H2 Roads, oh, the, the remission. Oh, officially, uh... Oh, the, spr no, the spritzers have been out. Oh, have they? Okay. That's different. You're talking about the Bud Light Seltzers, which also are right there. Yeah. Oh, Thonkin' yeah. about? Thonkin'. Oh, there's the, uh... Is this a new one? Or did we do this one? Kiwi? I don't know. That's a, that is a new flavor. Natty Light? That is a new flavor, because the all they had was cherry in this, so this is Maybe a new flavor. Maybe we can find a single with that. I yeah, we need, to, that we, need to get a, we need to get a... <laughs> single of that? Some of those. That's one for sure. <gasps> What is that? Twist the, the back tea. of the box. Get it. Oh, God. We're drinking that tonight, aren't we? We've already drank one of these before. It's amazing. I know, I've seen the video, but I wasn't there for that. And we were oh. just like, I wonder if they still make those. It was like, oh. It looks better than it did when we bought yeah. it. Look, there's Moosehead in the 12-pack. I didn't think it was a real thing. Oh, wow. <laughs> I wish they had cans. Molson's. Oh, oh. yeah, they still make some, Henry's. Some, uh, Lenny, Lenny's spritzers. Lenny's make spritzers? Spritzen. Beer with a splash of... Oh, it's beer, beer with a splash of seltzer. Oh, that's interesting. That's weird. That's pineapple, strawberry, raspberry, lemon, oh, look. grapefruit. They got the Ginny Bach Spring Edition, eight nine nine for a 12-pack. It's a good nice. deal. Oh, there it is. I see it. What? See what? I see it. Oh, the new Budweiser? No, the, the new uh, oh, Blue, Moon. Blue Moon. Citrus Wheat. Light Sky. Yeah. We'll grab one. We'll see if we can find a smaller pack, but grab that 12-pack for right now. Which one is it? The, the Light Sky. Light Sky. You see the new Budweiser while you're over there? Uh, what was it called? Uh, it's gonna be. It's gonna look like a regular Budweiser can, except it's gonna be in a gold, gold label. Uh, it's called Budweiser Nitro, I think. Okay. Uh, it might be over there. Yeah, I don't see it over here. I don't know. Most of the Bud Light stuff is right here. What is Which that? They got more of those St. Patrick's. What day. is that Keystone over there? Why is it so pink? No. What is? That? No, Maybe not Michael. again. <laughs> Why? Why? It's a Keystone Light Raspberry Lime. Oh, it's a, it, it's a beer. It's not a... Yeah. It's not a seltzer. It's not a seltzer. That's a beer. We need to review that, too. Do we? Look at us they have. They got that Red Dog. They got that Red do Dog. Really? Yes, they do. Oh $16.99. Wow. Look, look at this white claw display. That's pretty dope. It's actually kind of legit. There's no, no laws when you're drinking claw. For real. Oh, there's a 12-pack of it. Just go, go ahead and grab the 12 pack of the Keystone oh, fucking. Why? Oh my god. No, we're gonna There's some Mickey's. I still never had that before. No, Mickey's is good. This, but god, why? Oh, well, too bad they don't have the 40s of it. They got old style too. Hey, there's my go to Miller High Life. Let's go into the. Uh, the Kula. Ooh, little Kings. Into the Little Kings is good. We're going to uh, uh, Christian Moreland. I think they own Little Kings. I didn't even know they right. made 12 packs of Colt 45.
looking for a Snapple, man. You know this mic picks up everything, right? This mic picks up everything. Wait, 1800 coconut, that's new. That, that is new. Interesting. Uh huh. See anything else fancy? Oh, this is the one we've had a bunch of requests for. Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. I knew I'd figure it out when I saw it. Got some tequila 3030. You know, I'm a fan of this. Look at that. 1921? Yeah, yeah it's, it's, it's got a 90. That's a fancy old bottle. That's a big ass bottle of Petron. I've See, seen a Roco lately. That's a new thing from them. I feel like I feel like a lot of companies are trying to copy the Patron bottle. Like a lot, have the same sort of silhouette. It's because people want to buy it. Is that bourbon bottles. Hell yeah. Huh. A lot of them have that weird, like Jim Beam, Evan A lot of bourbon bottles do look very similar. Why is that red? Very common. Why is that? That red? is very red. That's. Oh, that's. What is this? Is that just a torn label? It's textured. That's interesting. That I can't decide if that label is, is that torn or bottle chunky or is it? Nope, they all look like that. It's supposed to look like a hand blown glass is thing, this, I guess. Where's this chocolate tequila I keep hearing about? Man, I don't know. Rod and Eric and all those guys were mentioning a chocolate tequila. Oh, okay. Chalky tequila. Chocolate. Chalky. That's chocolate rum. You gotta get, you gotta get a Tommy gun of vodka, Ugh, because why? because reasons. It's the worst vodka ever, probably in there. Yeah, it tastes real bad. It, I mean, so the bottle is the bad. you're buying the bottle. You're not really buying. Get anything you're not be here? really buying the vodka. You think we should get a crowler all here? Hurt. Mm. You have a whole growler to take home with you. I can also take a crowler home with me. And give me one good reason why I shouldn't. What gun? Well, there's another gun. Oh. Uh, that must be like... That must be a more common thing than I thought it was. Oh, Wait, what? Why? Brian. What? Why? Oh, no. Why? That shouldn't exist. Still has vodka. No. It's got to be better than the than the apple whiskey they made. You die, still has vodka. The apple whiskey was just horrible. And it was $20 a bottle. Try mixing with fucking chili powder. Vodka and chili powder? No, it still has apple. Oh, that because sounds like... Candle, that's mixing madness to me. Oh. That stuff looks interesting. This it looks does. Like, this looks very, very catfishy over here. Yeah, yeah, it does. These very large bottles of vodka with the flippy that are only tops. Eleven ninety nine, mm -hmm. and they are flavored. Yep. See, some of these vodka prices are like reasonable. That 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 is a price vodka should be. That. And then again, Grey Goose happens. That is not a price vodka should be. Mm, no, not really. Still Man, look at this. That looks like cleaning. That looks like a cleaning supply sort of thing. I don't know what that is Wait, exactly. how does that make sense? What? Do not question is it because, the, the, is it the because reasoning. because it's in a plastic? Oh, look, that's glass, too. I going to say because it's plastic, but it is <laughs> not plastic. I didn't know Stella made flavors. What is what? It looks like something you would clean something with. Elite ultra luxury vodka, ninety nine dollars. Be lit, bro. Be lit. Oh, he's crystal. Jesus, that's a hundred and fifty three dollar crystal head there. Why is it a hundred and fifty three dollars? Because it's camo or something weird. Huh. All right, let's uh go right here. Why? Why did you make that? Don't don't make that noise. I don't like it. Make whatever noise I want. Uh, okay, Batman. Batman. <gasps> They have a lot of, uh, I didn't know there were this many flavors of Pinnacle. Listen here, Bruce Wayne. They have an entire section of just Pinnacle. Three olives. We've never done three olives. It's a Fruit Loop one. Again, not that bad of a price. Yeah. Though we've never had any requests for it, it's probably why we haven't done it. We have had... Albert. All the Svedka flavors. We know about that one, Cucumber Lime. Oh, we certainly do. 
The rosé. Oh. It's a gluten-free vodka. Whitney, there's a hockey vodka. Um, okay. All right. Look, it does make sense. It's New Amsterdam. Smirnoff Sours. People are walking. Let's get out of their way. Oh, yeah. Yep, thanks. Would you like a peppermint Smirnoff? I know every time I ask you, the answer is the same. But this time around, how about how do you feel about it now? Sweet potato soju. Interesting. Not even paying attention to me. That is a water bottle full of alcohol. That surely is. Are you sure that's alcohol? That looks a lot like water. That is 17.2 percent alcohol, alcohol by volume, bro. Oh well, alrighty then. That's a water bottle full of alcohol. Say, uh, Sometimes that's what you need. Have a seat. Radar. Boss. I am the king. And it's good to be king. This chair is not actually comfortable. Like at all. This, this chair is not even close to comfortable. Let's <laughs> more ah. <laughs> You might need all the vodka or Coke. Some bowels. Um, good question. You could mix a yuhu with, uh, well, anything, anything flavorless. Get you some. <laughs> Got some delirium up there. We had some of that. Fresh off tap. You know, I don't think I've ever actually had pirate ale, but every time I walk past, I want to get it. You are a pirate, after all. Rhubarb ghost. That sounds oh, interesting. Oh, you know what? I do love me some rhubarb. Huh. Yep. Height extra code. Oh, that Extra looks... cold? What the actual shit is that? No, that'd be snow. Oh, this is South Korea. There's the Viking blood. That they, do, they do have a little bit of meat in this section right here. Shoot. Honey meat. Here's the fun section. The fun section? You mean the liqueur section? No, oh, no. Oh. Oh no, this is the fun. What is that? Is Why? this... This is a gi this is a giant plastic buzz ball of chalk teas. Why would anybody want the chalk teas? Man. This makes me scared. Keep on walking. Uh huh. A little bit of a little bit of everything here. Oh, there's some more UV Go flavors. We did uh, those. I feel like UV uh, wasn't UV Go Go pretty decent? Yeah, I'd like to try the other flavors, but I don't want to buy more four packs. Yeah. Be really good if they made a sampler. That'd be great. This is just some of the mixed wait, wait, wait. stuff. Let's... Spicy margarita, pre-made spicy margarita. Yeah. Jaeger over there, Fireball. There's a lot of the flavors. Cactus juice is a good choice. And I haven't been able to find it like anywhere. They have it here, but yeah, we bought two bottles of it. Interesting. Some horchata. Uh, you gotta have horchata. It's necessary. Some black heart down there. And Ocart up here. That's a new one. Ocarty Limit that. Oh, whoa. Whoa. What? Why is that so expensive? Special. Bacardi Limited Limitada Reserve. Look. Oh, that's... It's Catfish's favorite rum. Oh, it is. They have pineapple flavored. For five ninety nine. That's how you know it's good. You want to get you some Admiral Nelson's while we're here, Catfish? I'm thinking about it. It's $5.99. <laughs> it's $5.99. Oh, my God. They have a lot of flavors. Why is there a... Why is this rum called Pirate and has a picture of Buddha on the front of it? But, but Buddha and Pirates, that's two very different things. I feel like I 
Yeah, I've actually had some of this rum. Silly Jerry's. Not a huge fan of Silly Jerry's. There's a new one. Savage Apple Silly Jerry's. Well, that's, uh, that's interesting. Savage. That one's $150. Well, the box is very nice. Mount yes. Gay? For price tag. Malibu's okay, too, but I haven't had too many of their flavors other than the orange cream and the regular coconut. Oh, here we go. Kraken Black Roast. Oh, the, this was full yesterday. Well, that kind of makes sense. The Kraken Black Roast so was pretty good. One. Again, people much, must have been watching our reviews. Cause, must have been. Yeah. I think Fuzzy snuck back over in the middle of the night. Some old rum. I don't know. It's just literally called old rum. Oh, no. Alexis. Oh, 151. No, that's not allowed. Gosling's 151. That'll That's happen. just something no one we'll needs. Come back one day. Wait, wait, wait. Check out the Cruzan with the Cruzan tied to the Cruzan. Get a bonus bottles. Yeah, see, Cruzan's $9.99 for the flavors, which is pretty good for the flavor. I like Cruzan. All right, so peanut butter whiskey, it's, it's getting really popular. You know, it should be popular, though. That peanut butter whiskey we had was pretty good. Oh, look, there's uh, some more disgusting. More still house. That shouldn't exist. Yep. There's screwball at the top. They must uh. have just got it in search a new... More Basil Hayden's, mm -hmm. 46. The travel bottle. <laughs> it's a single serve? That's right. That's right. It's enough for the rest of your life because you'll die. All the Woodfords. Feeling like a Woodford. Well, they really do day. have all the Woodfords. Look at that. Gentleman Jack. Eh. It's George Remus. Bone snapper rye. Lots of uh, lots of bullet there. Some uh, Jefferson's aged at sea, which is always interesting. So expensive. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, it's not super bad here. Uh, a lot yeah. of places that I go, it, you wind up paying a little over a hundred dollars for Jefferson's aged at sea. Let's hit these last couple uh, aisles here, and then we're gonna. We're gonna wrap it up because we're gonna get a pint. So. Oh yeah, because we're gonna go to Braxton Labs. Probably after this video, maybe before. Who knows? It'll we're, be up eventually. We're gonna get frisky with it. You'll never know. Uh, tell them we're due. Twenty-five dollars. Uh, Bushmills. Eh. But that was okay. What's your favorite Royal Crown? Uh, Crown Royal. Or you mean? Crown Royal. I ordered, what? You haven't even drank that much. Uh, the apple's actually pretty good, but I want to try the black. We haven't got to that one yet. I haven't drank that much today. That's what you mean to say. I mean, you did earlier. Oh, yeah. Well, I took a nap. You need a belt buckle. Does this come with a belt buckle? It does, in fact. What? It is a real belt buckle, too. And uh, isn't it Canadian? So, this, I mean, this is the Canadian section. Come over here, some more, some weird stuff. There's a pear in a jar again. We came up with that one before. Uh, yep. Remember, I joked about this. Uh, we saw this one before, and I joked about this. Oh, they put the bottle on the tree, and they grow the pear in it. And then it's it turned actually, out they actually did that's that. That's actually how they do it. So. Uh huh. I wonder if this is—is is this a a shot pourer? No, it is not. No. I can't remember what there was a tequila bottle. that I bought There's one time one. that came with a shot pourer in it. Sure, that's a very alcoholic pear. Oh yeah, that pear will get you a lit. Here's another one. Catfish's favorites up here. We've got Paul Mason mango. Brandy. Paul at. Paul Masson. Which one of your favorites? Paul Mason Peach. Yes. Paul Mason Peach. Delicious. Delicious? You like that? We've had That's the, your thing? We've had the pineapple. Like now this is what now this is important to talk about. This giant display of Guinness. <laughs> it's a Guinness train. The Should Guinness train? All aboard? Uh, I'm I'm on the Guinness train. That sounds fantastic. Now we're getting into some more of the crap stuff. These from the bigger craft guys. Mm -hmm. Again, um, Rogue telling me to share my beer. I don't like it. Sea Dog, Magic Hat up there. Uh, some Dogfish Head, Sam Seventy Six. Uh, <laughs> flying Dog ain't nothing but a thing. Uh, sweet Baby Jesus. We all know about that Jesus. Jesus. Is it too juicy? Some little tiny bottles of Omega. Yep. Like you need in your life. Uh, 
Oh, platform. They had a couple. They, I think they had more than one tent at the uh, at the uh, old monkey. Yeah, the event good. today. Oh, look! It has a it has a Simpsons donut on it. Hey, what kind of donut? That's a Simpsons donut. Oh, let's be real. That looks. Exactly <laughs> that doesn't look exactly like a Simpsons donut. It does. Come on now. It does. Color's all wrong. Dark Horse. We haven't done a Dark Horse beer in forever. It has been a little while. Never released a lot. That looks interesting. Sour, crush. I'd be into that. Mm-hmm. There's a Country Boy. I don't see. They don't have the Dynasty here out yet. They just came out the double IPA. Oh yeah, I had some of that today too. Yeah, draft. It's good. Mm-hmm. It has that uh, traditional country, like the really juicy citrus hops flavor. It's against the grain and their very strange collection of labels. Which cause... are they're solid, but I don't. I don't. I almost, they're almost overrated. Uh, go ahead and say that. I mean, a lot of people like Against the Grain. They are kind of expensive for a four-pack. Goodwood. Uh, we didn't have good experiences with the brewery at Goodwood. We'll leave it at that. The beer is good, though. The beer is okay. But the beer is pretty good. The owners are a different story. Oh, be nice to those guys. They just got done opening up a new place in Louisville. They don't like us. Well, that's I don't like us sometimes. Staff beer selection. Um, Oh maybe yeah, that middle section there. Do we'll, have to look uh, at the staff beer se selection whenever I come here. Oh, they here. have a cannabis double now. That's necessary. Mm. There's, a, there's oh, they got prickly pear back. Ooh, Ooh they have. Yeah. Mm. It's Shiner's one of their best beers. The Schmorris is good too, though. But I know a lot of their beers are hit miss. That's a new one. Narwhal. Um, haven't had that one. Too hard. It's great. That one is great Wife's too. The Wolf, that's yeah. pretty good. There's Norwal up there. Not a big fan. Narwhal. Evil Twin. They're always making crazy beers. Oh, yeah. Is there a big... Oh, look at the dust on the bottom of this bottle. It's good. Holy cow. All right, let's go over here. Did the boys go get a beer? Uh, I believe we yeah. may have been abandoned we'll by the boys. Let's just finish this section. We got some more Braxton Lab stuff right here. Mm -hmm. I mean, if they're going to be... In the store. We're back. Going to wrap this up. I'm really this glad they started putting in 12 packs. A fun video. We were excited to come out to the fire source again. Um, this is our last day. We had some issues with this video, so we're getting a little, <laughs> we're a little tired. The sound was hurt. It's 11 o'clock at night. It's pretty, <laughs> it's pretty late, but we're going to go get some beers. So. I'm impressed they keep Braxton Labs open late enough for this. Before the end of our trip. Yep, and then we're going to go for a second round at Hofbrauhaus yes. because we have to. Got to get that cream puff. The cream puff.